Uh, hello guys and uh, welcome to my new tutorial. In this video we are going to create uh, two screens, one welcome and the second uh, login screen, UI design. And in uh, my second or next video I am going to implement this exact design in Android Studio XML. So first I have created uh, a one white background and uh, one rectangle uh, with grey color. Uh, so I will create now two big uh, circles on top of this uh, rectangle in order to create a new shape you'll see now so this second uh, circle will uh, we will change its opacity a little bit and we're going to put it uh, somewhere like that so we are going to use our first 100% opacity circle and uh, and this rectangle to create a new shape oh sorry this shape and now we're going to use the second uh, uh, circle and uh, our shape to create a new shape like that. So we're going to change the color of our new shape. Uh, the color should be red. And now we're going to set it up uh, here somewhere. So we need to adjust uh, our, re our gray uh, rectangle a little bit. Uh, we need to change uh, one uh, corner radius. Uh, down uh, right radius uh, so let's just adjust this uh, shape a little bit and now okay now let's change uh, the third sorry the third uh, uh, corner radius to 25 like that or maybe hmm, 26 27 26 yeah 26 will be perfect. After that we're going to duplicate our shape and uh, switch its side and change the opacity to 40. Now we're going to create another one. We're going to duplicate another one shape and its opacity should be uh, let's say 15 maybe. We'll see now. Uh, okay something like that and now we have our uh, background created so next we're going to create the text uh, welcome uh, its color should be white a font should be sf pro display bold and uh, size should be 50 or 51 exactly next we're going to create one more text with a light font or thin maybe uh, opacity should be uh, 50% and the text uh, will uh, be nice to see you again like that and should be just below the welcome text above 30% uh, opacity all right um, somewhere like that and uh, after that we're going to create a button which will be a login button uh, width uh, should be 162 and the height should be 53 radius let's say uh, radius will be 27 full radius and we're going to create text uh, login uh, font should be light or uh, regular I'm going to lower down a little bit and set it on the center here uh, size should be 24 Okay, and we just need to create one more text down below. Opacity, full opacity and uh, gray color should be uh, text you are not a member. And uh, next, register. Register should be uh, red color and uh, bolder font. And just let adjust it a little bit on the left. All right, uh, let's lower it down to 16. I think it's fine now. Okay, let's just change this font to light. And there you go, we have created the welcome screen. Next, we're going to create a login screen. So uh, let's copy this uh, layout or artboard, just holding uh, Alt and Shift. And let's rename it to login screen. 
So first we are going to delete uh, our background because uh, we are going to let it just be a white background this time and this text will stay here with the exact uh, text and uh, we're just going to remove uh, our nice to see you again text and we're going to change the welcome text and of course delete those uh, red and gray uh, shapes here all right uh, now let's change the color of our text to gray and we'll rename it to hello there and because this text is a little bit longer we are going to need uh, to uh, decrease the size uh, we're going to move our login button a little bit down okay and we're going to create uh, two new fields input fields for username and password radius full radius and uh, width should be 300 and height should be 43 uh, margin between those two elements should be around 15 and margins between uh, login button and input field should be around 30 for example so uh, opacity for those two fields will be 15 something like that and uh, we need to create uh, we're going to put this uh, down below a little bit and we need to create one more text uh, for example need help and question mark and let's set it up here on the right side of the login button okay oh, sorry let's undo this uh, we're going to create a new text for uh, email address and the password uh, okay, so let's re rename this uh, to someone at gmail.com uh, We'll change the color to gray Set it on the center of this field A little bit on the left And let's create a password uh, We will uh, create the password uh, in uh, circle shapes So the user cannot see uh, what he is typing so it's hidden let's create uh, I don't know like nine those uh, I think we should we should uh, decrease the size of those circles so let's let's remove uh, those circles and uh, decrease the one a little bit okay width and height should be eight and margins between those should be four like that and let's copy and paste okay now let's put it on the left right there okay and there you go uh, we have created the login screen as well now in my next tutorial we're going to uh, implement our welcome screen in Android Studio XML so keep following my channel and see you in the next video